Welcome to the SOLIDWORKS Electrical video series. In this video, we will cover creating new projects, libraries, and parts. To begin, click the Projects Manager option from the top left tab. From there, select New in the top left corner of the menu. You will now be able to choose the template that you would like to use from the drop-down menu. In this case, the 2013 Force Robotics template. You may now enter the name, which in our case we'll use as test, as well as other project information that you would like to have. Click OK. SOLIDWORKS Electrical will now create a project using predefined sheets, options, and templates that you have selected from your template menu. This may take about 30 seconds. Once the project is created, you will see the sheets available on the left and you are ready to start work on your new project. Next, we will cover creating a new project library. From the library tab, select library manager. Here is a list of all the available libraries you have. In this list, select new in the top left. Enter the name that you would like your library to have and select the different options of categories that you would like to include, such as parts, manufacturers, and so on. If you scroll down, you will see that your library is now created. Click OK. Finally, we will create a new part. In the Library tab, select Manufacturer Parts Manager. From there, select Add Part. Next, name the part Select a manufacturer, additionally select what type of part it is, select the library that the part will belong to, Enter a description for the part so that you'll be able to find it. Next, we'll select a line diagram symbol to associate to the part. And for 3D, you can navigate to find the 3D part you would like to associate with it. Finally, we'll add circuits. These will dictate how your part will interact with other parts in an electrical diagram or control line diagram. We will select a motor type circuit. Because it is a motor, we will add positive and negative terminal types. And these are going to be grouped under power. Once you have added your circuits, click OK, and then close. Thank you for watching our video. For more, visit youtube.com slash SolidWorks.